Hey family, it's your girl Amaka here and welcome back to my channel. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, welcome to my channel. If this is the first time you see my face, you know what to do to join the crew. Click the subscribe button and smash that like button. It won't cost you nothing. Okay, we are going to be talking about what I do to remain calm and unbothered. I don't really get into this. I would like to say like the last one is really what has transformed me more, more than every other word, like to just remain so in my space and just loving myself more. Okay, so let's get into this right now. The first thing that I do is journaling. I know I've talked about journaling before on my channel and I really always say journaling, journaling, journaling because journaling just really helps you get in touch with yourself. Like helps you to create that relationship with yourself. Yes, yeah, just like you have friends, you have relationships with other people, you text people. Same way you feel like you need to text people. The same way I feel like I need to write down in my journal. You get so it's like I have my fr myself is my friend. I know it sounds. Yeah, I don't know how, know how it sounds to you. Some people can sound lonely, which is not, or it can sound weird, which it is not. But it is like being friends with yourself and you can't go crazy in your journal you know why whatever i just want to write i just write whatever it is i want to write about my day how i'm feeling what i'm thinking about or what i have to do or just whatever is just whatever it is that i want to write it's just my journal if i want to draw to draw it just do whatever it is that i want to do and it's perfectly okay so that's something that just makes me hard like keep in touch with my feelings my emotions so i know that okay i can keep a track record of myself kind of like yeah to see how you know, over the years i've evolved or i can just go back to my journals and just see things it's just it's just like a nice memory with box or memory lane or how would i put this just freestyle basically go crazy who's going to read it it's not just your journal so yeah generally you're just like creating a relationship with yourself and me personally i've always like notice that generally it just helps me get in touch with myself with my feelings with my emotions with everything i just kind of gives me clarity so on to the next one on to the next one oh. deep breaths Ooh. <sighs> let's do this together breathe in for five seconds hold it for two and breathe in for another five I don't know if you guys did that with me or I did that with myself, but basically, deep breath, taking deep breaths where I get to exhale for a longer period of time. Okay, you can breathe in. The ones that I do is I breathe in for seven seconds, hold it for three seconds, and exhale for ten seconds. I just make sure that the exhale is like more, so I'm like, it's longer than the inhale, so it just calms me down especially when my heart is racing or like i'm like scared or anxious about something or something like that makes my heart is racing or anytime like really just do deep breath it just helps to just keep you in the state of serenity calm back into your own energy honey back into your energy one is practicing gratitude practicing gratitude that really just helps me to just see the things that i'm missing like oh you 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 feel like you don't have this or you need this to be happy i miss not on the things that you already have around you so i just practice gratitude like thankful for the things that i have thankful for you watching this video thankful for my ring lights thankful for my camera thankful for everything that i'm surrounded by and that i have so like practicing gratitude just really made me just like you know be more grounded in myself kind of i don't know like if you get what i'm saying just be more grounded and just see things that i was missing out before so yes there's that that's that you know they spend less time on social social media is just like for me it's just a place where i go and promote my youtube videos and just go offline it's like i don't want do anything there or post or i just post my videos basically social media for me just for promoting my youtube and a lot of people spend a very intoxicating amount of time on social media which is like crazy because there's a lot of toxic 
energy on there and yes it has its good size but i have a whole video on social media and its effects i will link it down in the description box if you would like to check that out i go in detail on how like it has affected our mental health and everything so you can watch that just check the description box down below for the link or maybe i will put it up here for you guys to just click this up here to just check it out but i just try to reduce the amount of time i spend on social media because it's like that have ideas that are false that are not true to who you are because of what other people think so it's just not too 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 good to stay on it like too, too much so i try to reduce it as much as possible <laughs> mm. read more books I just had I just started reading more and more books about topics that I'm ignorant about or I want to know more about. So just literally whatever it is that picked like I'm, I fancy or whatever it is that I really want to know about, I really like. Plus I have this online library where I can get any books that I want. So it's just very, very like nice to just have lots of books that you can just read and but the fictions, if you like fiction like and stuff, novels and whatever, and non fictions, anything you want, literally poems, whatever, autobiographies. Reading books just really just broadens your perspectives, makes you see the world in like a different lens and you're like, oh, I really didn't know that before. You just you just get to realize how dumb you are, how much you don't even know. You'll be thinking you know but you don't be knowing really so yeah these are just five things that i do that just makes me to stay calm and unbothered because i'm too busy doing my own thing to notice what you got going on or whatever it is you're trying to throw my way nah 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 so yes thank you so much for watching this video if you did enjoy it please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't to join the family and i will see you in my next video peace out